Morning, how are you all doing? It is exactly three weeks today that Dad had his stroke. I came down in the morning, found him completely unresponsive, just with his head slumped forward. Um, all he could say was, I don't know. So he kind of could understand there was a problem, but he didn't know what it was. He couldn't explain. He couldn't understand. And um, yeah, it was pretty traumatic. Rush to hospital, blue lights and everything. I'll leave a link in the description to that if you would like to know a little bit more. But this is the story of how his recovery is going now. And compared to how he was three weeks ago, it's absolutely remarkable. Today, more positive news. We went to visit Dad. He is, of course, still in hospital. He will be there probably for quite a while, I would think. He still got confused with some things, like he could remember that I had to sort out the TV because the Sky TV... The one box wasn't talking to the other box in the other room and it didn't work. Um, but he could remember that, but he couldn't remember his brother's name or his granddaughter's name. So it was kind of strange how the brain is kind of working. But his stroke was on the left-hand side of his brain. And um, he's had numerous strokes that have kind of, some of them have joined together, some haven't. So he has got these kind of numerous kind of, like a cluster of strokes. It's affected his speech, obviously his cognitive ability, and it's affected his right arm and his right leg. So movement-wise, that's quite difficult. But he is moving his feet a bit like this now. He can raise and lower his leg, and he is moving his arm a little bit more, which is great. So things are improving slowly. Hopefully things will continue as they are doing to improve um, even more. Now, the movement Dad's got in his um, feet and lower legs is great. He can't walk yet and needs help um, getting in and out of bed, onto the chair and then back again. So hopefully that will improve. Um, the physiotherapists are working with Dad, as are the occupational health. So, you know, fingers crossed um, that gets better. Also, cognitively, Dad is OK most of the time. But there are times, um, as I said, where he does forget names and can't remember people and things. I guess he might end up working with a speech therapist. Um, and, and all of this is ongoing. Um, he is going to be in hospital for a, a while yet, I think. But things are going in the right direction. So if you like this video, please consider subscribing. That would be awesome. It'd be great to um, continue this story with you. And I'm also going to be continuing to work on my camper van. It's been an ongoing project and uh, yeah, that's happening. So if you'd like to know more about that, make sure you sub so you don't miss it. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.